we checking back in a hump or so wanted to report on asap rocky multi-platinum selling artist you know he's been nominated for a couple grammys over the years you know asap rocky somebody who jumped into the music game on a major level back in 2011 around 2011 but since then you know he's been able to jump off into different business ventures whether it's fashion or acting so on and so forth asap rocky hit the headlines a couple of years ago for his um, alleged involvement in a shooting that took place outside of a hotel in Hollywood back in November of 2021. And the guy who allegedly was shot was his, his friend, you know, a, for, a former friend and another member of the ASAP mob, a guy by the name of ASAP Relly. Relly has claimed in court that, you know, he was he's one of the co-founders of the ASAP mob as well as the person responsible for bringing ASAP Rocky into the group before everything took off, you know, on a major level. And for those who don't know, you know, the ASAP Mob is a hip hop collective that started in the, the early 2000s, you know what I'm saying? But um, they didn't really get an, uh, a national spotlight on them until ASAP Rocky came out when he dropped his single Peso back in 2011, then went on to drop his debut album that sold millions of records and you know from there the rest is history you know asap ferg is another one out the click who was able to gain a national a major following because of his music you know asap yams although he didn't make music he got known you know what i'm saying before he passed away in 2015 but you know asap hasn't been buzzing like it was over more than a decade ago when rocky was in his heyday you know what i'm saying when he was in his prime and allegedly, you know, the majority of the members in the clique have fallen on hard times and pretty much are broke in so many words, according to what ASAP Rally has shared in court. ASAP Rally in particular, you know, he started experiencing issues with Rocky after another member out of the ASAP clique, out of the ASAP mob, passed away. A guy by the name of ASAP Josh, he, he died in October of 2021. And uh, his mother needed assistance. You know, she needed she needed some help getting his body shipped back to New York, from from what I understand, and also needed help paying for the funeral. You know, ASAP Rocky, being one of the breadwinners out of the out of the clique, um, stepped up and said he would help her out. Somehow, you know, ASAP really got the impression that Rocky didn't keep his word, which led to him sending him some texts. You know, disrespecting him. He later found out that Rocky actually did keep his word and stepped in and helped, you know, with the funeral. So one thing led to another, man. Words were exchanged and they agreed to meet up outside of the W Hotel in Hollywood um, in early November of 2021. So it's, it's like less than a month after ASAP Josh passed away. But they ended up meeting up. Um, ASAP really testified in court that when he met up with Rocky, Rocky had two other members with him, ASAP 12V and another guy by the name of ASAP Eels. But um, he said that Rocky, you know, pulled a, pulled a gun out, pointed it at his, his chest, at his head and at his stomach and pretty much told him that he would kill him before letting off a few shots and running away. You know, Relly said one of the shots grazed his left hand, but other than that, he was he was OK there was some security footage from the incident showed in court it was security footage from parking garages that were in the area of the hotel which allegedly showed rocky pulling a gun out during an altercation with somebody but it didn't necessarily show any shots being fired but uh a couple of gunshots were heard in the video from what i understand according to different reports and um the footage also allegedly shows rocky running around the corner you know after the uh, shots went off in april of 2022 you know asap rocky was arrested at the los angeles international airport in connection to the shooting that took place back in november of 2021 he was actually coming back from barbados with his you know his lady rihanna they had just got back from a vacation man they was on a private jet so just imagine you know you feeling good man and you you get back and the police arrest you but yeah, he was taken into custody, man, and um, charged with charged with two counts of you know felony assault with with the firearm. They also got a search warrant and executed a search warrant at his house in Los Angeles, man. But they didn't find a gun that matched the shell casings from the scene. 
and uh, Rocky ended up posting a half million dollar bail in less than three hours, you know, and was out a few months later in August of 2022. Rocky pleaded not guilty to the charges and has maintained his innocence, man, pretty much throughout this entire ordeal. He was actually required to plead not guilty again in January of 2024 because they found sufficient evidence, according to reports. You know, his pretrial date is set for March, you know, March 2024. If Rocky is convicted, you know, of his charges, he faces up to 24 years in prison. Rocky's lawyer has claimed that this is pretty much over money, man. That Rocky didn't actually shoot the guy, but the guy ASAP really hasn't been receiving support from Rocky and, you know, in business ventures or things like that. And um, he's looking for, he's just looking for a money grab, you know, because Aside from the criminal charges, ASAP really is suing Rocky on the civil side as well for assault, battery, as well as emotional distress. And he's looking to get paid some thousands out of that as well. So right now, ASAP Rocky, you know, he's facing up to 20, 24 years in prison if he's convicted. But, you know, he's maintained his innocence. We'll see how everything plays out. Shout out, shout out to everybody rocking with a humble soul, man. If you're not already subscribed to the channel, hit the button ASAP. Drop a comment. Hit the like button if you mess with the video. Until next time, I'm going to holler at y'all, man. 100.